because um, because of the coaching I do, um, it's quite difficult to demonstrate uh, stuff when you're unfit, um, and you're kind of trying to portray a certain type of body shape and you know type of fitness style that you should have when uh, when coaching. So it's kind of more sort of a role model to the, you know, the kids you're coaching to. to you know, show them that they should be training, they should be eating right um, if they want to go on and play a decent level of hockey. I've known Ali for quite a few years, um, so we've done a lot of county coaching together um, and I've heard some really good stuff from Serbson about what he does with them, with their junior elite stuff. Um, so I thought I'd give it a go. Uh, I have been disappointed so far. So my goals, I think we started about 18 months ago, um, but it's been on and off training. Um, and initially it was just to get back to playing hockey, because uh, I had a knee injury about two and a half, three years ago. Um, so I was trying to get back to fitness, trying to recover from that and rebuild muscles around the knee. Um, but like I said, been on and off. Um, I like, tore my hamstring twice, so it did really help. But um, we're now back working on working on the hamstring, working on quads to try and spread all that area around the leg and the knee. In terms of achievements, um, I'm a lot more conscious of my posture, so I constantly find myself kind of sitting while driving or while working at home and going, oh, I, should be, I should have a straighter back, I should have my shoulders back. Um, so that's something I've thought about, and then obviously the nutritional side. So I try and take a lot more care now. It's, it's not always working, but I do try and take a lot more care in how much I eat and obviously what I eat. So for me, the first thing I tried to you know, limit was the busy drinks. I've done pretty well with that. Um, and there's other stuff I've probably not given up. So. <laughs> Definitely. Um, I think everyone, well, Ali here at Silverfern, kind of really gets to know, know you and know, get to know what you want to try and achieve and why you're doing training uh, and then he tailor makes the programs so that you can reach targets and he constantly tests you, constantly pushes you um, and I haven't left a single session thinking I could have worked harder so yeah yeah he definitely definitely would recommend. <laughs>